okay. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh I am from group 3 and now we will present about managing knowledge and this is our group member Angger Arga, Dika Bagas, Iqbal Dikozi, me, Javier Dari, and then Muhammad Fauzi okay the first one is what is the role of knowledge management system in business knowledge management is a set of process to processes to create store transfer and apply knowledge in the organization much of firms value depends on its facility to create and manage knowledge Knowledge management promotes organizational learning by increasing the ability of the organization to learn from its environment and to incorporate knowledge into its business processes. There are three major types of knowledge management system, enterprise-wide knowledge management system, knowledge work system, and the last one is intelligent techniques. What types of systems are used for enterprise-wide knowledge management and how do they provide value for businesses? Enterprise-wide knowledge management systems are former efforts to collect, store, distribute, and apply digital content and knowledge. Enterprise content management systems provide databases and tools for organizing and storing structured documents and tools for organizing and storing semi-structured knowledge such as email or rich media. Often, these systems include group collaboration tools, portals to simplify information access, search tools, tools for locating experts, and tools for classifying information based on taxonomy that is appropriate for the organization. Learning management system provides tools for the management, delivery, tracking, and assessment of various types of employee learning and training. Number three, what are the major types of knowledge work system and how do they Profit value for firm, firms. The knowledge work system or KWS supports the creation of the new knowledge and its integration into the organization. KWS requires easy access to an external knowledge space, powerful computer hardware, that can support software with intensive graphics, uh, analysis, document management, and communication capabilities, and a user friendly interface. Computer aided design, CAD system, augmented reality application, and virtual reality system which create an interactive simulation that behave like the real world, require graphics and powerful modeling capabilities. The business benefits of using artificial intelligence for knowledge management. Artificial intelligence can be used to process information that comes from various sources and with various contents to make sure the, that the information is relevant, valid, and stored well. Artificial intelligence can do that job repetitively with consistent performance and result and with minor errors. Because of that, the company who use artificial intelligence for knowledge management have increased quantity and accuracy of their information and also they can maintain their information safety that will lead to, inc to the company's increasing performance and trust. Thus, in conclusion, what types of systems are used for enterprise-wide knowledge management and how do they provide value for businesses? Enterprise-wide knowledge management systems are firm-wide efforts to collect, store, distribute, and apply digital content and knowledge. Knowledge Work System, or as we say KWS, support the creation of new knowledge and its integration into the organization. Computer-aided design, or should we say CAD systems, Augmented reality applications and VR or virtual reality systems 
which create interactive simulations that behave like the real world, require graphics and powerful modeling capabilities. Expert systems are most useful for problems of classifications for diagnosis. Intelligent agents can be programmed to navigate through large amounts of data to locate useful information and, in some cases, act on that information on behalf of the user. I'm Iqbal Gozi. That's the conclusion. Thank you very much.